most people's knowledge about the Avery Equestrian Department consists of lessons, shows, and the many awards it has won over the years. What people don't see is the amount of work it takes to keep the amazing animals happy and healthy and the barn clean and running efficiently. And who are the diligent workers that do the necessary tasks to keep the facility in tip-top shape? The ES freshmen. They work early mornings, evenings after long days of classes and writing lessons, and on top of all of that, each student sacrifices two weekends a semester to take care of the horses and other extra tasks that need to be done around the barn. Let's take a look at some of the work they have to do and what they learn from it. Um, what times do you usually have to show up for a.m. and p.m. and everything? It, for the first semester, it starts earlier, but once like they know that you have the hang of it and can actually get it done in a decent amount of time, then they push it back to 6.30. And then PM, most of the time you're here anyway because you have bond duty before, or like, if you have to, you have your riding class before, and so you just stay here. But for our class, it doesn't start till 5, but we usually end up starting earlier because we get everything else done. And then I think the other class starts at 4. And then you're generally here to like, for us it's six, it usually takes like an hour. Um, and then weekend duty, you have to be here at eight and you're here all day on Saturday and you come for a.m. on Sunday and then you come back for p.m. and you do p.m. on Friday. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> That's a lot. <laughs> is it worth it? It is. It's a lot of work, but it's just getting the hang of it. And then, I mean, you just learn to enjoy it. And think about how much work you do. So Z, what are some of the basic tasks and duties that you have to do for AM and the week, I'd say weekend duty? Uh, so first, when you first get here, there will be horses that are staying in, like there. So um, we bring all the horses in, check their feet for thrush and stuff like that, check <laughs> from being out in the fields all night. And then we go upstairs, do the same for those horses while somebody blows the aisle down here, basically making it look clean. And then we rake upstairs and stuff, basically get the barn clean upstairs too. And then we're good for the morning. Do you think that the work that they have you do here kind of prepares you for the real world? Oh, absolutely. Um, yes. Being a been a working student before, I know that you have to do all this stuff. So... It's good to learn how. I know a lot of people come in here with like no prior like work, working in a barn experience. So it's good for them to learn. And it always helps you out. Like it's good to learn how to clean this many stalls like in a fast amount of time. Oh boy. <laughs> uh, basically like it's good because like when you're just starting out in the industry, it's like all you're really doing really is like stable work just to like get a chance to like work with people. So it's best to like be proficient, be very good at that, you know what I'm saying? So, mm -hmm. All right. What would you say is one of the toughest parts about bringing horses in in the morning? Um, well, sometimes it's the weather and it's just all muddy and everything, so you have to fight that. On top of some of the pastures have two horses in them, or this one has five, and getting them out of the gate without letting the other horses out poses a challenge a lot of times because they're all hungry. and. They know where their food is, so they're trying to go to it. So they just try and like bust out of the gate. But for the most part, they they're pretty good about it. They know that like if they wait, then they get to eat anyway. But along with the regular AM and PM duties, the weekend crew will perform other tasks such as bleaching the fencing around the arenas, deep cleaning saddles and bridles, and thoroughly cleaning the lounge room and tack rooms. Along with the group work of AMs, PMs, and weekend duties, each student has a maintenance horse that they are in charge of caring for. This is Jordan Anderson and her maintenance horse, Jiminy. Can you explain to me what it means to have a maintenance horse? Yeah, so a maintenance horse is one horse you're assigned for the semester, and basically your job is to keep them looking nice, keep them clipped and have their mane pulled to a certain length so it doesn't look all long and scraggly. And three times a semester there'll be maintenance checks where Valerie will come and make sure like your horse's mane's the right length, 
He clipped all this like extra hair on his legs and like his ears and under his chin. <laughs> Through these jobs, the students learn to take pride in their work, to have high standards for the care of their horses and facility, and how to be a team player in and out of the saddle. Taking care of the horses creates a special bond between the horse and the rider that can only be experienced through getting your hands dirty. I hope you have found a new appreciation for the Avered Equestrians and encourage you to come and cheer them on next show season.